Alright everybody, what is up? It's Thunder. Welcome back to the COD Casino. And by the way, fellas, if you're seeing some frames skipping all over the place, it's because this gameplay is taken off of my uh, Sony Game Cap. The Sony Game Capture. Didn't have the PVR running, theater mode was busted, so I just hit the PS4 share button. And yeah, the PS4 share, the quality is horrendous, but I really wanted to upload this gameplay to prove a point. Ooh, get Benny Hill in the back of the head, son. Ooh, get outplayed, baby. Taste the rainbow, son. <laughs> so anyway, fellas, in the last upload, I spoke about the maps that are coming to Modern Warfare. We're getting 10 normal maps for multiplayer. Four of them are for the big team game modes, the 10v10, the 20v20. You're going to have six classic 6v6 maps at launch now they did say they're going to be adding more maps along the way so it's not like we're just going to be playing on six maps you know throughout the whole game's life cycle maybe just six maps for the first month then they'll add some more i mean it could be cool it could be good right i mean it's not like we're just going to be playing on six maps and then the four other huge you know sea town 2.0 maps for the entire game's life cycle that's not how it's going to go down so, and the map names actually got leaked, fellas, so I'm going to put them up on the screen for you guys to see right now. So, here are the list of normal multiplayer maps from Modern Warfare. Bow! There you go. You've got Anya Place. You've got Azir Cave and Azir Cave Nighttime. Yo, who else can't wait for Azir Cave Sandstorm map variant? Azir Cave Flooded? Come on, e Flood the cave. That way you can't camp in or else you'll drown. Azir Cave Hurricane. Yeah, I cannot wait for the map variants, man. That's going to be so fresh. Then we've got Dead Zone. Then we've got Euphrates Bridge, Hackney Yard, and Hackney Yard Nighttime. We played Hackney Yard in the beta. Hackney Yard was uh, it was okay. We got uh, Guranza Raid. I think that's that big giant 20v20, 10v10 map. Piccadilly, Petrograd, Gunrunner, and Gunrunner Nighttime. I remember we played Gunrunner. That wasn't too terrible of a map then we've got spear and spear nightfall uh, a night version of the map listen i don't know about you guys but i don't consider weather changing new maps it's still the same map okay so there's 10 maps here four of them are giant ones like uh grand granza raid and i don't know which of these other ones are going to be the big ones for the 10v10 20v20 but there you go fellas these are the maps we're going to be playing with at launch uh and you know what fellas like I said, we played the beta maps. I wasn't really feeling the beta maps, man. Not at all. Uh, and usually in a beta, these are the best maps. They put their best maps forward in a beta. So I have to assume that the rest of these maps are going to be worse than the maps we played in the beta. And if that is the case, fellas, I am definitely looking forward to the remade maps. Because I don't know what it is with Call of Duty. But it seems like they just can't make good maps. Like the old maps way better than the new stuff look at the maps that were in cod 4 world at war mw2 mw3 i mean dude those maps were superior the maps that are out now i mean black ops 3 had some good maps right you had uh, combine and you had fringe you know black ops 4 had a few decent maps i guess uh, i mean you know black ops 1 had some great maps but it just seems like the, the newer COD games, man, the maps are just a mess. So I am looking forward to this tweet right here from the Gaming Revolution. He put out, somebody asked him a question. Uh, this guy, Lazarus Chris Amaldis, <laughs> he said, yo, Gaming Revolution, will there be a small, chaotic 6v6 map like Shipment, Strike Zone, Nuke to, oh, I would love to see Strike Zone in this game. Not Nuke Town, though. I'd love to see Strike Zone in, in Modern Warfare Rebooted. That would be fresh. Uh, will there be a 24-7 6v6 playlist with this map only, like 24-7 Strike Zone or 24-7 Shipment Wars? Yo, how about 24-7 Azir Cave? Azir Cave 24-7? Come on, e! <laughs> Yo, who wouldn't love to play on Azir Cave 24-7? <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, it would be amazing to always have this option to play if you wanted. So, Gaming Revolution responds to Lazarus, Chris Amaldis, Shipment, Rust, Terminal, and a new version of Wet Work set inside the ship by the containers from the crew expendable and more classics are coming after launch so yo i that's pretty cool i had no idea wet work was coming i heard sub base was coming from mw2 maybe that was a mistake maybe they meant to say wet work i knew shipment rust and terminal were coming by the way fellas shipment is going to be a gunfight map only 
Uh, and Rust, Rust, I'm looking forward to Rust in Modern Warfare because Rust in Modern Warfare 2, I hated it because there was always some D-bag that would climb up into the middle with one man army tubes and just tube everybody and get streaks and ruin the damn game. And if you were that guy, let me know down in the comments section. If you were that guy that played on Rust and the first thing you did was go to the middle of the map to climb up the tower and noob tube everybody with one man army danger close, l let me know if you were that guy. I know my boy 8 Thoughts. I know he's that guy. The first video I ever seen from 8 Thoughts, man. He was talking smack about somebody, and he was noob tubing the crap out of everybody on the map. That's the first 8 Thoughts video I saw back in, like, I don't know, 2008, like 10 years ago, a long time ago. Shout out to the homie 8 Thoughts. Uh, but yeah, I know he was that D-bag <laughs> that was noob tubing everybody. So that's pretty cool that we're going to be playing inside the sub in wet work, underneath all the, the meteor shower, uh, the frag times 3 spam. I'm looking forward to playing wet work inside. That's pretty cool. But... See, fellas, the old maps is what can save Modern Warfare Rebooted because the new maps, I wasn't feeling them, fellas. I'm sorry. I know a lot of people get triggered when I talk about the maps. Listen, man, if you need, like, grief counseling or if you need a hug or something after listening to me saying I don't like the maps of Modern Warfare, yo, go do what you got to do, man. Take care of that or just click off the video. If me saying I don't like the new maps of Modern Warfare triggers you that bad, just click off the video and, you know, go get some counseling, go get a hug from somebody. Just do something that makes you feel better. Go sip on some chamomile tea. Do something that calms you down, man. But I didn't like the maps. But I did like the Modern Warfare gameplay. I thought the game, the core gameplay was solid. Just the maps, oh my god, straight doo-doo. So listen, I think if they do remaster more of these old favorites, like Shipment, well, Shipment's going to be in 2v2 gunfight, but like Rust, Terminal. Uh, I, you know what? I don't even think Terminal is that great. To be honest, I don't know why they keep bringing Terminal back. Of all the MW2 maps, Terminal? Why, why Terminal keep getting brought back? I don't get it. I mean, Terminal's all right, though. Don't get me wrong. But, I mean, you got High Rise out there. I mean, dude, there's, there's better Modern Warfare 2 maps than Terminal. I don't know why they keep uh, remastering that. So, I put on Twitter, I said, yo, the only hope Modern Warfare has is old maps coming back to save the game. We know we got Rust, Sub Base, which is possibly wet work now. Uh, shipment and terminal coming back. What other modern warfare maps do you want to see remastered? And now a whole lot of people in the comment section were screaming MW3 dome and yes dome has to happen MW3 dome has to be remade, but this dude right here Matthew Harvey I'm gonna put him up on the screen uh, B26 at B26 UNG he hit it pretty much right on the head man He said maps. I'd like to see back from MW2 Afghan. Yes, Afghan is a great wide open map. Now, I know what people are going to say, oh, well, that's just a bigger version of Ezir Cave, Thunder. Afghan had the big cave, everyone camped in the middle. Wrong. <laughs> Wrong. The cave was not that big. All you got to do is shoot a noob tube in there, you kill everybody in the place. It's over. Uh, Afghan was a much better version of Azir Cave, okay? I mean, you can't compare the two. I mean, come on. Is, is there anybody that likes Azir Cave better than Afghan? Afghan has flow to it. Azir Cave don't. So he wants to see Afghan, Favela, High Rise, and yo, these next two maps, Scrapyard and Skid Row, would be incredible in the Modern Warfare reboot. And Wasteland, another wide open map. I would love to see that just because it changes up the game. There's, the Modern Warfare rebooted maps that are out now are just loaded with buildings. It's just too many damn buildings. So some nice wide open maps like Afghan and Wasteland would definitely be welcomed. Uh, Favela, High Rise, Scrapyard, Skid Row, all excellent maps I'd love to see remastered from MW2. Uh, and then he even put some MW3 maps underneath this. He's got Sea Town. Sea Town is a fantastic map. Dome. Uh, like I said, when I put that tweet out, everybody was screaming for Dome to come back. Uh, Resistance is a pretty good map. Hard Hat was a great map. Hard Hat was definitely a great map from MW3. Village, Mission. I mean, these are all fantastic maps that could come back. Now, I know I said 10 maps. I think I gave you guys 12. But whatever. Giving you guys more is never a bad thing. So, if they remastered these maps and put them in Modern Warfare Rebooted... I think the game would be great. I think it would save the game, to be honest. Uh, I mean, I don't want to play on big, big maps that, that just don't fit the game. Like, I did right here. Look at this. I mean, I got streaks. I stole streaks. And still, I, can, I couldn't even hit the score limit, man. Just running around aimlessly looking for people. Mr. Boggs. Yeah, thanks for the thresher, homie. <laughs> I appreciate it, man. Uh, I, Mr. Boggs, what is that stain you have in your hand there? You know what? On second thought, I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know what that white stain in the palm of your hand is right there, man. I, I'll let you guys figure that one out. Oh, my. See, that's why we can't have the player card anymore, man. That's why they're taking the player card away. Anyway, 
What do you guys think down in the comment section, man? Are you guys hyped about seeing some classic MW2 and MW3 maps? And maybe they'll even remaster some more uh, original Modern Warfare maps. Uh, maybe something like Backlot. Backlot would be a cool map to put in here. Or uh, Overgrown. Overgrown would be a cool map to see back in Modern Warfare Rebooted. Uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. Thank you guys all so much for watching. And I will see you guys on the next one. I'm out. Peace.